How to Change Owner of Shared Calendar Outlook Have you ever wondered how to change the owner of a shared calendar in Outlook? This can be a bit tricky, so let's break it down step by step. First, it is important to understand that ownership of a calendar is tied directly to the mailbox where it was created. If you created the calendar, you are its owner. Sharing the calendar does not transfer ownership to another user. Now, while you cannot change the owner, you can manage who has access to the calendar and what they can do with it. This is done by assigning different permission levels to users. To do this, right, click on the calendar you want to share and select properties. From there, navigate to the Permissions tab. Here, you can click Add to add new users or modify existing permissions. There are several permission levels you can assign. The free busy time option allows users to see when you are busy or free, but they cannot view any details. The reviewer permission lets users view all details of the calendar but does not allow them to create or edit events. If you want to give someone more control, you can assign them the author permission. This allows them to view all details and create new events, but they cannot edit or delete existing ones. The editor permission is the most comprehensive, allowing users to view all details, create new events, and edit or delete existing events. While you cannot directly transfer ownership, giving someone editor permissions effectively allows them to manage the calendar as if they were the owner. However, they will not be able to delete the calendar itself since that action requires ownership rights. If you really need to transfer the calendar entirely, including its ownership, you might consider exporting the calendar from your account and importing it into the new owner's account. This method involves a few manual steps and may not be ideal for every situation, but it is an option if needed. In summary, while changing the owner of a shared calendar in Outlook is not possible, you can manage access and control through permissions. This allows for effective collaboration while maintaining ownership. So, remember to assign the right permissions to ensure everyone has the access they need.